Thank you for tuning in. I wanted to uh, share this update. I'm currently testing a droneception in the simulator with the Phantom 4. I just finished testing with the Mavic Pro. And this feature uh, we're about to roll out in the droneception beta as well as roll this to drone pan, drone repeat, and drone blocks. Now this feature is incredibly useful uh, for those hobby users and especially commercial users uh, that care about the airspace around them. Hopefully everyone should, but uh, what this feature will do is I'll zoom into the iPad and, and demonstrate how it works. And what these are are the FAA sectional maps. Uh, for those interested in the VFR stuff, the visual flight rules, I'm going to simulate this mission. I'm going to go ahead and just fly forward. You can see my aircraft moving and let's say that I'm ready to preview in Droneception. We'll have our waypoints. Everything is set up and what we can do just as a beta feature, we'll probably make this more usable in the future. I can long press and what it will do is show uh, the FAA sectional maps for the area around me. And you can see that we have a coverage of the entire United States. We're working on adding support for other countries uh, based on user feedback. This is a great way to just do a quick toggle, look at what's going on around you. You can see there are several airports uh, with Class E airspace around them. And then unfortunately we can't zoom all the way in. This is about as detailed as we can get right now. But I can just long press, toggle back into my Google satellite view, know that everything looks okay. Then I'll go ahead and launch the mission. You can see that it's uploading. And then the simulated mission uh, begins. You can see that it's taking photos. The aircraft's moving. We'll take our nine photos and then return to home. And while that mission is executing, I can always long press. It's not a very long mission. It's only going 50 meters away from my current location, but we can just take a look at the airspace around us. And for areas that don't have coverage, you can see that you're still going to get the standard satellite view. We're gonna be working on Australia next, just based on user feedback, and then we'll move to other areas. So definitely welcome feedback, and anybody that knows of uh, VFR maps for their area, please post a comment below. We'd love to include it. The FAA maps are free, but we've seen in a lot of countries, such as Canada, uh, where you have to pay for these maps and sometimes the downloads are incredibly expensive so obviously we want to keep this feature free so we'll continue to uh, improve our coverage and just wanted to share that quick update if you guys have any questions or comments please post them below and until next time thanks for watching